After exterminating a nest of goblins, Goblin Slayer comes across a certain ring with the burning gem in it while collecting the level tags of fallen adventurers. However, upon taking it to his blacksmith to be sold, he's rejected due to the potential dangers of handling an unidentified magical item. Instead, Goblin Slayer is advised to consult with an adventurer who could identify the ring for him. As he makes his way to the guild, he's met by the receptionist who requests the witch adventurer to look at his ring. Unfortunately, however, she's also unable to identify its properties but tells him of a place along a small river outside of town where he could find someone interested in the ring, recommending he bring apple cider with him. Coming across the cabin, Goblin Slayer knocks and is beckoned to enter. Inside, he tells a hooded figure looming over a desk he seeks to identify a ring. While they don't seem interested at first, suddenly they grab him, asking him if he's felt a spark from it, revealing the figure to be a woman. Upon inspecting the ring and mumbling an incantation, violent sparks suddenly surge from within its gem. Asking him where he found it, she's taken aback when he tells her it was in a trash pile in a goblin's nest. Insisting he sells her the ring, she beckons she'll pay any price he wants for it, be it coins or other means. However, Goblin Slayer responds that he simply wants something that'll help him kill goblins. Shocked by his reply, she laughs hysterically, further heightened when he also offers a bottle of apple cider as payment. Unable to maintain her composure, the Archmages of Electricity falls to the ground in a fit of laughter.